Hi people, what's up? Welcome back. A uh, very warm welcome. Okay, so I'm filming a sit down video after a very long time and also a very special message that I want to share with people who are not watching me for the first time. Basically, they are familiar with this face, okay? So, at the end of this video. Now, let's jump to the content part. Today, I'm going to discuss five habits that changed my life. When I say change, it really does. It helped me to become a better person, a better version of myself, and which is something that I think that we all should somewhere uh, thrive for. On YouTube, you will find tons of these videos. Uh, as far as I remember, I used to binge watch them when I was like in when I was like two, one to two years ago. No doubt that all of them are really very helpful. However, in this video, I have tried to mention the habits that are easier, uh, simpler and that are slower that means that these habit take time take your every day but at the same time it's not that strict it, and once you have uh, once and once you inculcate these habits in your life your life is going to be like awesome <laughs> so now let's start with the first one making my health my priority when i was in a six let's say six from six to ninth standard right now i'm in 12th so from six to ninth standard i used to be a very sports person like sports was something that always attracted me i used to run i used to play participate like in kabaddi kho kho i used to love those athletic games but what happened is um, whenever i tried to just like go a step ahead my health pulled me a step back and believe me that don't feel great i learned it very hard way that make your health priority it's really very important to take care of yourself it's your body yaar it is very important to give your body the care that it needs i see healing as a very slow process uh, whether it's like mental healing physical or emotional healing it's very important to just do those small step every day or the little things that i can suggest you to uh, make your every day effort towards your health are first hydrate yourself now i know that many people may have suggested you this but i have tried it like earlier i used to not drink like earlier i used to drink just like one or two glasses of water each day now i'm that person who drink like two to three liters of water every day and believe me there has been a lot of difference i can make a shot on this now let's see the second one but for now let's see the second one which is to eat a fruit daily it can be seasonal fruit it can be your favorite fruit that you like for now mangoes are ah, yellow yellow ha <laughs> okay so move your body a bit you can start from like yoga cycling running whatever interest you even even walking i walk after having dinner walking will help you a lot so start taking care of your body and eat right because uh, you are what you eat keep in mind that you can also quote my health my priority anywhere if you that could remind you that yeah it's your body and you have to take care of it second one i am going to give you a hint before telling about it listen carefully once it gone it never comes back i give you like 5 second 1 2 3 4 5 okay it is time time management uh, according to me it's such it is such a like complex thing and also a very crucial aspect if you want to be a successful person or if you want to have a balanced healthy happy life now i have been trying to manage my time since a long time and most of the time i fail it's all right to fail uh, time management is again i said you a very complex thing here i would like to suggest you some tips that you can inculcate in your life and, uh, and then your time will be in your hands and you know how to use it okay so if you are a beginner then the first thing that i would suggest the first thing that i would like to suggest you to do is make time logs like what i used to do is uh, for example from let's say 11 to 7 or 11 to 6 i slept and then 6 to 7 like each hour used to, i used to log my each hour i used to log my time or so and at the end of the day i used to see okay itna time phone pe gaya itna time sone pe gaya itna time padhai aur itna time kya kya and how i have to improve it now second thing that you can do is uh, for most of us uh, at least for me it was i saw that most of the time i was on my phone so i decided to set a screen uh, record or what uh, a screen timer you can say a screen timer on my phone that okay how much time on uh, i am on my phone and i used to set and i till now i uh, set a timer of every app like for youtube one hour for this that like according to that so you can also try that the third oh hmm, not work <laughs> uh, one more thing that you can do is make a schedule a uh, timetable for listen time table is not for like following each thing it's just for tracking your time understand that for most of us students we fear making time table now don't fear making a schedule because you are unable to finish all the task you have planned i never i like there are rare days one or two days in which in a month with in which i'm like okay all of my works are done 
if you don't want to make a time table right now make to do list every night before sleeping for the next day uh just like work 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 and then after the day when the day is like finished you cut 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 on on the things that you have done and it it is like, like it is very satisfactory to like cross them cut them now let's move on to the third one which is let me see what it is i forgot okay okay <clears throat> planning okay planning your months and week a few months ago i filmed a video in which i shared how i made a planner from a notebook and from that time i have been planning my months my weeks my days now let's jump to the benefits of it the first one is that it is going to help you a lot in managing your time the previous tip that we discussed it is going to help you a lot in that second one your life is going to be a lot more productive believe me my life has been really a lot more productive after making a to do list or after planning my days and third one imagine yourself uh, like very demotivated uh, in a position where you are like i can't do that it's sitting on a table not sitting on a chair <laughs> hi ram sitting on a chair and uh, be like i can't do that and suddenly you see a diary or a notebook or a planner in which you plan and you just go through it and see wow i have done this much means i can do this also and that feeling so basically you can look back and self motivate yourself self encourage yourself and gather that motivation to work again and fight again fourth one is gratitude from this whole pandemic time what i think we all as a mass have learned is first share kindness and love second is to be grateful for for all those things even the little things that we have it's very important to be grateful this one single habit have actually changed my life in the sense that i have started uh, thinking from a whole new perspective now my approach of thinking about anything has been so much positive has been so much like very oh, very peaceful and like and the best part is that i have been much more happier and much more content in myself content with whatever i have and that feels so amazing like smiling face uh, a very happy heart feels so uh, and that feels like you have soul in your body and like very high spirited i uh, believe me this one habit you have to try it and it's it's again a very slow habit so it would take time as i have shared a lot of tips in this video i'm again going to share for this one it taught me that life is about enjoying those little things that we have and uh, just share love and kindness to the world to the people around you to not just people animal and by the way today is world environment day so happy world environment day you can listen or write affirmations on daily basis about like your health your work life your uh, personal life your like i'm i'm for example i'm happy and healthy i'm whatever i'm doing is go- whatever i'm doing is worth it i am i can and i will like these few statements that affirmations are like those few sentences that motivates you or that helps you that help you to remind uh, your vision your aim your life purpose one more thing that you can do is uh, before sleeping write all the things that you are grateful for uh, in that day or bef- or after waking up make a list of things that you are grateful for for a few people it's not possible to make a list uh, due to the lack of time as i don't make a list every day what i do is i set at a place before sleeping and uh, just be thankful be grateful for the things that i had that day for exam and for those special things like i have noticed that each day a special thing happen and that make you a lot more happier for example today someone commented on a video of mine and that made me like that made my day honestly and i was so happy <laughs> so i'm grateful for that i'm grateful for all of your love thank you so much now the last one is self reflection no matter in which phase of life you are whether you are like a child or student or a working woman or man self reflection makes your life so much easier it helps you in uh, like living in the present moment living in the moment and learn from each day believe me learnings from each day learnings are a very important part of life at least they are very important li- part of my life what i do is sometimes or most of the time i go to my rooftop and like thanda thanda hawa hawa what i do is sometimes i go to my rooftop and think about life about like my life what i'm i doing these days uh, what are the mistakes that i'm doing and how i should improve myself i plan my uh, as i told you i plan my days is i find solution of my problems and that analysis in whole helps you a lot to go further uh, go further and be more productive in your life uh, maintaining each day as or uh, like not just like one day it's like 24 seconds sorry it 
you can also journal each night before sleeping again if you don't have that much time what you can do is or let's say what i do is i journal on my special days like when i feel like journaling then i journal i'm a beginner in journaling so what i do just like date time and that day and then about like all the things in my heart right 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 my signature and that's it what i do is <laughs> sometimes sometimes again not daily i made it i like to meditate breathe in breathe out that's it not very restricted or not very like much i like to honestly i am someone who like those free slow habits much more than those strict habits that's all i wanted to share in this video hope it added value in your life if, let me know if you are going to try any habit and if you have tried how it have worked for you now for people who have waited uh, i for the special message that is thank you so much that is thank you so much all of you for subscribing we crossed 100 subscriber after a year of starting our channel now i want to say a lot of things to all of you first thing i'm very very grateful second thing when i think about this journey more than subscriber count what more than subscriber count uh, i have learned a lot of things a lot of skills a lot of lessons in my life and that that helps and that makes me feel so much better a lot in this journey like i have not crossed a lot like i have not 1 lakh 1 million oh my god one day i will i hope so okay so uh, i have not done a, like it's not a that it's not that of uh, that um, it's not that of a big deal to cross 100 subscriber many people doing like very few hours or like very few days what i think i have learned the most in this journey is first be patient the fruits of your hard work is going to be worth it it it, it is all going to be worth it honestly the things you are working on if you are working for something in your life thumbs up you can do it second thing uh, now when before starting my channel or like first few uh, days uh, first few months of my channel after starting my channel i used to think that 1k subscriber not that of a big deal bahut jaldi ho jata hoga aur 1 1 lakh subscriber not that of a big deal but now i have understood the value of each person like connect each person or each subscriber or each viewer who watch your who watch your videos and connect with you and people who comment uh, very sweetly on my channel thank you so much all, to all of you it makes it makes my heart so much mm, i feel so happy honestly so now i would not do a lot of bakwas i'm planning to make a video in which i rate my previous videos soon uh, let me know if you would like to watch that for now that's all thank you so much for watching see you we'll meet you in the next one um uh, make move your body a bit move your body a bit मूव uh, क्या हो गया मेरा बाबा यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू मेक अ शेड्यूल राइट नाउ मेक अ स्केड्यूल पहले ऐसा था टाइम टेबल आई एव जस्ट लाइक ओह यार कितना बोलती हूँ यू यू थिंक दैट यू यू आर यू यू आर अ फेल यू आर नॉट डूइंग समथिंग